in this newly released body cam footage. You can see and hear the encounter Keith Muriel is having with three former Jackson police officers on New Year's Eve. Give me your left arm. Give me your left arm. The 41-year-old being pinned down and tased multiple times by now former officers. We have seen actions which are excessive, disheartening, and tragic. These three former officers, James Land, Avery Willis, and Kenya McCarty, can be seen in the video tussling and tasing Muriel. They're now being charged for his death. Two officers are charged with second degree murder. Uh, one officer, Mr. Land, has been charged with uh, manslaughter. Attorneys representing Muriel's family had an independent autopsy done on the 41 year old. They say Muriel died due to being severely beaten by the former officers and because they failed to render aid to him. Mayor Shokwe Antarla Mumba expressing that the actions by these former officers do not reflect what the city of Jackson or the police department represent. We want to build a vision of public safety which is based in community love and also based on trust within our community. And these actions do not appear to be consistent with that vision. We strive at the Jackson Police Department to create community trust. When we fail, we create community distrust. I would ask of the citizens of Jackson to continue to support the dedicated, hardworking men and women of the Jackson Police Department who put their lives on the line every single day. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.